This video demonstrates how to copy a column to a separate Excel sheet by using the Python library OpenPyXL. This is a follow-up to a video I did on copying a column in the same sheet, which can be viewed by clicking on the link above or the link in the descriptions below. It was requested by a viewer and I thought others might benefit from it as well. In our testing document, you can see a single column of random numbers in column A in sheet 1. I will copy this content to column A of sheet 2 using Python. Here I'm bringing in the workbook as WB and selecting the first worksheet as WS1 and the second worksheet as WS2. I will then be saving the work in the cell below. To start this process, I need to find out the last row of data in the document. This is very important as it ensures I am capturing every cell of the column. The best way to do this is use the max row attribute of the worksheet. It's especially useful for very large data sets. You can see here that my max row is just 11. Copying the column itself to a new sheet is actually very simple and only requires this small for loop, which looks strikingly similar to the code in the video I did on copying a column within the same sheet. The only difference is the third line of code, which places the values in a new location. Still, let me walk through line by line to explain exactly what's happening. First, we iterate through a range of numbers, the first row being 1 and the last row being the max row variable plus 1. The range function doesn't include the second number in the range, so I must add 1 to it to guarantee I am accurately capturing every single row of data in the column. I then access the value of a given cell by using the worksheet's cell function. As this for loop cycles through, I will be incrementing up the rows I am accessing, as you can see right here where I am assigning row to be the this row loop variable. I am also explicitly stating the column is the first column with the second argument passed. The value attribute of this cell will give me the exact value of that cell, which is one of the random numbers in column A. You can see I assign this value to the value to copy variable. Next, I have a value assignment happening. Instead of worksheet 1, I am using worksheet 2, as you can see by the WS variable. The cell I am accessing in every given loop is the exact same cell on the worksheet as the first worksheet. You can see the arguments passed to the cell function are all exactly the same. Of the cell for the loop, I access the value attribute and assign that value the variable I just acquired in the line above, value to copy. The value assignment causes the value to now appear in the exact same column on the second worksheet. Let me execute this cell, I will save the workbook, and see if we were able to successfully copy the column over. And there you have it. Each sheet now has the exact same content in the first column. So it is quite simple. You just find the max row, then use a ranged for loop to retrieve the value of each row in a column and assign that value to a new column on a separate worksheet. Thank you for watching. Please let me know in the comments below if this was helpful, and let me know what other features of OpenPy Excel, Excel, or Python in general you would like to see reviewed in future videos. If this was a helpful video, please do give it a thumbs up as it does help other people find this content. And do hit that subscribe button down below so that you know when the next video drops.